Hello guys, Borocube here, and welcome back yet again to Subnautica. And in today's episode, first of all I'm going to discuss a couple of things I meant to discuss either in the previous episode, or the episode before, which if you remember, is a bit... Um, the episode's a bit broken. But that's fine. Um, what do I want to discuss? Oh yeah, so... Uh, at some point, either before the first episode that I've recorded, like the broken episode if this goes up, or after, there's going to be a video with a new mystery guest. And hopefully, you know, you guys will like it, I'll hopefully edit it good, and everything will be great. Um, and also, I guess I will shout out a friend's channel. Um, called Gameovation, and he has quite short, quick videos that give you nice uh, bits of gaming info, primarily focused on Nintendo, but there's been one or two Sega um, information. So, it's like stuff like uh, new game trailers, um, like he did a video quickly letting you know about sort of like March 10th, like. Mario Day and other things. Um, so I'll leave a link in the description, check him out, give him a subscribe. I have sort of helped out with the one video, um, like not not really, but like a little bit. Um, but hopefully we'll be able to help, well, I'll be collaborating with him uh, sort of more in the future. So I'm, you know, I'm like very vaguely involved with that, at least at the moment. But yeah, make sure to um, check him out. Give him some love. And anyway, on with the episode. So, if you remember also a few episodes ago, I made the HUD computer chip for this bad boy, and I said, oh yeah, we'll check it out in this episode, and then I never did. Well, I sort of vaguely remember that. Let's find a data box, because apparently there's one nearby. Oh, it's over there. Let's get a looking, shall we? Oh, 100%. Beautiful. I'll leave those batteries charging. Well, Sadie's had her nap and now she's all nice and refreshed. Boop. Let's skydeck a go go over here. Wait, that's two data. THREE DATA BOXES?! Fuck yes, yeah, scanner room. Wait. FOUR?! Uh, Jesus Christ! Wait, that's, uh, that's an engine fragment, I've already got that. I thought I had already explorimigated you, but apparently not. Come on, rip open the door. <laughs> that's the... Authentic. Shut up, don't judge me. Okay, so what have we got here? Swim charge fins, but we can't actually make those yet. Okay, we need the laser cutter. I'm trying to work fast here because then I won't have to go and refill it. We need some new battery. Nope, that's fine. Now we need you. You don't get a battery. So there we are, me going, oh yeah, let's work fast, and then I have to go and change batteries. Have you ever noticed that I say things and then they immediately get contradicted by reality? Yeah, it seems to be a trend, doesn't it? Boosh! Well, that's a prawn suit. I already got that though. I thought I did because of the Aurora adventure, but I had to make sure. Now let's let's be sensible. Wait, what was scannable? Ex I thought it was something scannable, but maybe not. Whatever. Let's get back to Sally. Because oxygen's getting a little low. Welcome aboard, Captain. You're good to me, Sally. 
Why are you almost dead, Sally? What happened? Who even needs to scan things? Wait, I'm going to. That's I've just done a very dumb thing, but whatever. I'll fix it in a minute. I need to fix Sally, like, really badly. Okay. Oh, the, the scanner. I'm trying to maintain inventory space by making sure that everything at least has a battery in it, even if the battery is empty. If you're wondering why I took the time to stick a dead battery in it. So I'm just going to assume that I don't need to repair anything in here. And hopefully, things won't be attacking Sally whilst I've left her entirely defenseless alone in the middle of the deep dark ocean where everything wants to murder her. But you know, maybe not. Kachunk! Don't ask me why it's Kachunk, it just is, okay? Do I question everything you do? No. Jesus, this is like a trek. Is there like a way out over here? Maybe. What's behind this mystery door before I have to turn around? That looks like a w it is a way out. Oh, it's like a big U. I mean, I knew it was. Oh! And we've taken a good breath. Okay, what's over in our other mystery data box? Creature decoy. I imagine a creature decoy is useful, but I never actually used one, so... That was a prawn something arm. I've already got drill, haven't I? Yeah. Ooh, I do like caves, but caves are bad. Hello, that looks like a way in. Are you? Ooh! Oh. It's just into here. What a letdown! Ow, my face! Can I stop rubbing my face on everything? Do we have anything else to explore or loot or pillage? Nope. But... How? What's down here and how do I get it? Is there a vent? Can I go through the vent? Well, that end's closed off. Possibly. Possibly. Ooh. Okay. Shut up, Patty. Thirty seconds. Okay, so we've possibly got a vent somewhere. I bet it's in. Yeah, maybe. I mean, they're blocked off, though. Um, are you just up just prawn suit fragment? I don't need you. Oh, what about in here? Wait, are you? Oh. So it's not looking like I can get into it. So how do I get to those two data boxes? Like... Oh, but where's the way in? You can just... You can just swim in. Wait, can you? Sort of. Not really. Sally, give me air. Thank you. It's like that. How? Oh, 
I just want to get down with it. Well, I'm going to give up because I just I cannot figure it out and I don't want to spend like an entire episode just trying to get to two things. But we've got a fair few new things, but we can't really do anything with them. So, why don't Right. Wait, okay, okay, okay. We'll start scanning for new things. Like I say, the scanner room does use some electricity, but it's fine because we've got the solar panel, and we've. But more importantly, we've got the nice bioreactor. We'll just have to cram some more things into it. Let's. Whilst we're here, let's stick the titanium away and into common. Put some quartz. And into rare, we'll stick that stuff. And then into common, we'll also put that. Oh, we've got a whole fish, haven't we? Oh, and we can get our batteries. We're not having to juggle power constantly. Um. Sop. Is it just the one wreck nearby? Oh. If I mentioned that, it looks really cool. That is so cool. That's a disappointing thing, it looks like that's the only wreck nearby. Oh, we can just turn the scanner off then. Can I... I think so, can I grab another one at least? Because I bet... Yeah. Lantern fruit do not provide a lot of power. They At one point, they were like one of the best items for power for the bioreactor, but now they've been nerfed heavily. But you know, it's still a replenishable source of power, so... I can't really think of anything that's better, it's just you have to replenish him quite often. That looks like a massive islandy bit. Why are we glowing over here? Okay, just randomly ominously glowing. What I want like, what I really want is another nice chunk. Oh, this is the really cool one. Warning. Maximum depth reached. Hull damage imminent. I just realized what I should do. Like, what I should really do. Um, can you not? Excuse me? Do I go around biting you? We're missing a... We're missing a modification station part? Unacceptable. But I don't know where to go to find more. Mm, boop. Ooh, Ruby. Ow. Yeah, come on, you'll fit. You probably won't fit in here, but I'm gonna try it anyway. That, that. Oh no, oh no. Come on, wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Well, haven't you ever just wanted to ram your submersible into too small of a hole? Have you not lived? Sometimes you just gotta ram your submersible into a tiny hole. And not care about whether it fits or not. Oh, base is over there. Well, let's continue going this way then. Shadow horn. 
I wanna just like just be going along and then meep 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 meep. Yeah, I don't think I can really get to that. Then again, if we just carefully park up right about Warning. Maximum depth here, Pile damage imminent. and we just blitz down, I think we can possibly make it. That was a really fucking ominous noise. And we've got a new message. I wonder if it has anything to do with the terrifying noise. Ooh, data box. Cy with Cyclops depth module, I mean... I do really need that, so thanks. But I don't really need that yet. Flotation devices failed. We're flooding. Evacuate. Wait. I can reconfigure the O2 system to act as a bilge pump. Sounds like a straw. It's working. Okay, good news. We're alive and we've stopped sinking. Bad? The oxygen's going to run out in 30 minutes and we're 500 meters down. A time what capsule? Do we do? We'll have to use the remaining juice to send a distress call and build whatever gear we can. Then we find a way to the surface. Holy shit! That was ion power cells, I think. I'm gonna have to check that out as soon as I get back to Sally, but I really don't want to drown, so... Welcome aboard, so yeah, you can find time capsules from other people. Yeah, I, I had two iron batteries. Oh, and a thermo blade. I mean, I don't really like the thermo blade, but. Iron batteries! Look, 500 charge compared to. Oh my god! That was really useful! Okay. Oh, Sally. I have an iron battery. You can recharge them just the same. And let's get you an ion battery. That was super useful. Okay, back to base. Yeah, just a just a note for editing me cut that bit out from like just like warp us back to base you know what I mean thanks thanks future me oh hey, welcome back we've got a message Play partially translated broadcast Leave Sally out of this! Because they always, you know, obviously couldn't mean me. Here, I don't need... It's gonna be goopy. Oh, I needed one more blood oil to make benzene. And I needed one more deep shroom to make the hydrochloric acid. I can't believe of like the things. <laughs> That's made me sad. Oh well, I'm gonna end this episode here anyway. With that depressing revelation, so. As always, thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you've enjoyed this episode. If you did, please 
uh, give it a like, leave a comment, and if you haven't done so, subscribe to see more videos from me, and, you know, sometimes other people. And, yes, I hope I will see you in the next video.